it is impossible for most people to lick their own elbow. A study even showed that a minuscule percentage of the global population is capable of achieving this seemingly unattainable feat. This peculiarity, which you may have previously thought to be nothing more than a quirky tidbit, is actually deeply rooted in the sciences of anatomy and physiology. Human beings, as you may be aware, are part of the primate family. Our primate cousins, the chimpanzees and orangutans, are known for their flexibility. They can lick not only their own elbows, but also their backs, thanks to their versatile and flexible skeletal structures. Humans, however, evolved differently as we began to walk upright. Our upper bodies, particularly our arms and shoulders, became less flexible to accommodate this change in locomotion, which is why most of us can't lick our own elbows. Our shoulder joints are ball and socket joints, allowing for a good amount of mobility and flexibility. But unfortunately, it isn't enough to bring our mouths close to our elbows. Additionally, the length ratio between the upper and lower arms also plays a significant role. Even though humans have long arms compared to their body height, our elbows are generally positioned just beyond the reach of our tongues. Moreover, human tongues aren't long enough to reach our elbows, even if we could stretch our arms that far. Some animals, such as giraffes and anteaters, have long tongues that can extend far beyond their mouths. However, human tongues are much shorter and are predominantly designed for speech and eating, not for reaching distant body parts. This seemingly mundane fact can be a fun icebreaker at parties or social gatherings. You can even turn it into a game. Who can get their tongue the closest to their elbow? But it also has its roots in our evolutionary history, reminding us of our transformation from quadrupeds to bipeds and our shift from the flexibility of our primate ancestors to the rigidity that is characteristic of modern humans. As you sit there and playfully attempt to defy the odds, it's a curious reminder of the limitations imposed on us by our own anatomy and evolution. It's a testament to the diversity of the natural world where every species is uniquely adapted to its own way of life. It also reminds us of our inherent human nature, a constant struggle to overcome our limitations, to reach for the impossible, even if it's something as absurd as trying to lick our own elbow. So go ahead, give it an earnest try. You may be surprised at the extent of limitations or capabilities of your own body. But remember, it is impossible for most people to lick their own elbow. Try it now. Thank you for watching.